Hi, so today I'm stuck with a Windows 7 computer that has a dynamic disk and a Windows 7 installation CD that I want to try and install Windows from. But with this disk or any Windows 7 disk, Windows 7 cannot be installed on a dynamic disk. It needs a basic disk to be installed. So if we go ahead with the setup, uh, let's see here what it says. Well, it says Windows cannot be installed on this disk. Show details. Cannot be installed on the hard drive space. The partition contains one or more dynamic volumes that are not supported for the installation. So now we will convert this uh, dynamic disk to a basic disk for Windows installation and uh, this will destroy all the data that this disk has. So just be careful before you do this. Go to this option right here. Repair your computer and then we have to click on the first option use recovery tools that can help fix problems and then we go next start the command prompt okay so on the command prompt we're gonna type disk part Now we want to see a list of disks that are on the computer, so we will type list disk. Okay, we have a disk zero online, so we have to select this disk. Type select disk and then zero okay now you type convert basic convert basic it says it successfully converted to the basic disk now if, if this disk had any volumes or partitions on it, it would not have been successfully converted. So in that case we would have had to delete all the partitions first using the delete command from the disk part prompt. So we'll exit the disk part now. And exit the command window and then start over this let's go install now and let's go to accept the terms let's go next let's go advanced click there see the message here is gone the next button is now available to click click next and yeah, that did the job.